Okay, so first off, as you can hear, classical music, violins. This is the actual store. They've got the fall stuff out already. So, of course, right into the floral boutique area, which I'm going to resist and not bring anything home. Um, since I still have a full day, so I don't want it to wilt. Ooh, candy, nice candy. So lots of um, stuff here. Actually, I want some figs. I do want some figs. At least, wait a second, I gotta take a breakfast first. I gotta prepare for breakfast before I hit the road later. So let's go with actual food. It's obviously not the deli section. <laughs> Ooh, but there is some deli stuff here. I wonder what they got. Tater salads, macaroni and cheese. Sort of reminds me of a Trader Joe's, except of course a lot less packaged stuff, all of it's like fresh. I love these, by the way. I get some of this dried fruit stuff for um, and candy for Lisa, for Megan, and Duck Mimi. I keep on going for the fresh stuff, though. Lots of nuts. Lots of nuts. Okay. Um, they have my like grapeseed oil. I already have enough of this. I won't grab more. Um, oh, oh, natural peanut butter and almond butter. That's pretty cool. Anyway, so this is cool stuff ready-made stuff. This is awesome. Deli they have. Ooh, they even have Peking duck, beef wellington, whole frozen rabbit. They have the uh, tomahawks. Where is it? They have tomahawk steaks here, which I thought was pretty cool. There it is. There's your tomahawks. Huge. Porterhouse, ears, Dewey sausages, Italian kale chicken sausage. Look how huge those are. Okay, so I think I've hit there. Uh, I'll come back. I'll show you that because I really like their cheese deli section in the middle there, but. Cakes, of course, I'm not going to even try to do that. I thought of getting that for a little birthday celebration. It's better than when I see it at Publix. I don't think it'll last in the car that long. Um, good. Ooh, packets of herbs and spices. Dang, I wish they had one of these near us. I think there's a fresh market store near us. I'm not sure it's new, but it's a bit of a distance away, like maybe 30 minutes. I'm not sure if it's the same brand. I just don't know it's going to be as good as this one. And I love the decorations. I don't even know if you realize that there is like fall decorations on that ceiling or area. And that's really cool that they pay attention to those touches. There's a whole bunch of organic and really good chips. The frozen section for food is not that big, which is great. And a lot of it is international fresh food. Not nice. Um, oh, and international cookies too. That's nice. Okay, 
there's an Indian aisle. Let me see if there's anything I can grab. We've got bouillon, lots of bouillon. See, this stuff I would not find in the regular Publix near us. Chinese five spices. Okay, matcha. They got matcha? Miyagi matcha green curry. Oh, here's that tofu spinach miso soup that I like. Shiro. Okay. Nice. Those look like very nice sauces. Arrowroot, tapioca flour. Oh, they got everything. I like these. Talamarata. Maffledine. Oh, that's so funny looking. It's like pumpkins. Zuka is what they call it. So. Alright, so this, of course, is a deli. They've got so much cheeses, it's not even funny. I'm gonna go around and show you. I don't know if they have something to heat that up, but that sure looks good. Big plant rotini, egg rolls. What is that? I'm not sure. Cheese arancini. Must be what cheese balls. Smoked scamorza. The drunken goat. Semi soft goat cheese based in red wine. That's heavy. What is that? Almost five pounds. Behind you, sir. tons of sushi yesterday so I don't think I need to eat more but that's good to know all right too bad it's not Wednesday <laughs> <laughs> 